Hello and welcome to our video on the most expensive cars ever sold. In this video, we'll take a closer look at some of the most coveted and valuable cars in the world, and explore their fascinating histories and features. From vintage sports cars to classic luxury models, these cars have set records at auctions and captured the hearts of car enthusiasts around the globe. We'll share details about each car's unique design, engineering, and racing history, and reveal the jaw-dropping prices they fetched at auction. So buckle up and get ready for a ride through the world of high-end cars. Whether you're a lifelong car enthusiast or just curious about the world of luxury vehicles, this video is sure to be a treat. So without further ado, let's get started and explore the most expensive cars ever sold. The Ferrari 250 GTS WB California Spider is a rare and highly sought-after model, with only 56 examples produced between 1957 and 1963. The car is known for its stunning design and performance, and has become an icon of 1960s automotive culture. This particular California Spider, with chassis number 2935 GT, is one of the most desirable examples of the model. It was originally delivered to Italy in 1961 and later exported to the United States, where it underwent a restoration in the 1980s. The car's impressive provenance includes ownership by a number of notable collectors and enthusiasts, including Eddie Smith Jr., a prominent Ferrari collector, and Chris Evans, a British radio host and car enthusiast. In 2015, the car was sold by Gooding & Company at their Pebble Beach auction for $18.5 million, making it one of the most expensive cars ever sold at auction at the time. The buyer's identity was not disclosed. This sale further cemented the Ferrari 250 GTS WB California Spider's status as one of the most desirable and valuable cars in the world, and has since become a benchmark for other California Spiders sold at auction. The Alfa Romeo 8C2900B is widely considered to be one of the most beautiful and technologically advanced cars of the pre-war era. The car is powered by a 2.9-liter inline-eight engine, which produces around 180 horsepower, and features advanced engineering and aerodynamic design for its time. This particular Alfa Romeo 8C2900B, with chassis number 412041, is one of only 12 examples produced in the Lungo, long, wheelbase configuration. The car was originally built for the 1939 racing season, but due to the outbreak of World War II, it never competed in any races. After the war, the car was sold to a collector in the United States, where it underwent a number of restorations and refurbishments over the years. In 2016, the car was sold by Erm Sotheby's at their Monterey auction for $19.8 million, making it one of the most expensive cars ever sold at auction. The car's impressive history, advanced engineering, and stunning design have made it a highly coveted and valuable collector's item. The buyer's identity was not disclosed. The Jaguar D-Type was a highly successful race car in the 1950s, designed specifically for endurance racing. The car is powered by a 3.4-liter inline-six engine and features a lightweight aluminum body, disc brakes, and advanced aerodynamic design for its time. This particular Jaguar D-Type, with chassis number XKD501, has a rich racing history. It was one of the first examples of the D-Type to be produced, and it competed in a number of important races, including the 24 Hours of Le Mans in 1955 and 1956. The car was driven by a number of famous drivers, including Mike Hawthorne and Ivor Bue, and achieved several podium finishes during its racing career. After its racing career, the car was sold to a private collector in Switzerland, where it underwent a comprehensive restoration to its original specification. In 2016, the car was sold by Erm Sotheby's at their Monterey auction for $21.8 million, making it one of the most expensive cars ever sold at auction. The Aston Martin DBR1 is a legendary race car, known for its success in endurance racing in the 1950s and 1960s. The car is powered by a 2.5-liter inline-six engine, which produces around 250 horsepower, and features lightweight construction and advanced engineering for its time. 
This particular Aston Martin DBR1, with chassis number DBR1, 1, is the first of only five examples ever produced. It was built specifically for the 1956 racing season, and achieved numerous victories and podium finishes throughout its racing career, including a win at the 1959 24 Hours of Le Mans. The car was driven by a number of famous drivers, including Sterling Moss and Carroll Shelby, and has a rich racing history that has made it a highly coveted and valuable collector's item. In 2017, the car was sold by Erm Sotheby's at their Monterey auction for $22.6 million, making it one of the most expensive cars ever sold at auction. The buyer's identity was not disclosed. The Ferrari 290M is a highly sought-after race car that was built specifically for endurance racing in the 1950s. The car is powered by a 3.5-liter V12 engine, which produces around 320 horsepower, and features advanced engineering and aerodynamic design for its time. This particular Ferrari 290M, with chassis number 0626, has a rich racing history. It was built for the 1956 Mil Miglia race, which is considered one of the most challenging and prestigious races in the world. The car was driven by a number of famous drivers, including Juan Manuel Fangio and Eugenio Castellotti, and achieved a second-place finish in the race. It also competed in a number of other important races, including the 1956 24 Hours of Le Mans. After its racing career, the car was sold to a private collector and underwent a number of restorations and refurbishments over the years. In 2015, the car was sold by Erm Sotheby's at their New York auction for $28 million, The Mercedes-Benz W196 is a historic race car that was built for the 1954 and 1955 Formula One seasons. The car is powered by a 2.5-liter straight-eight engine, which produces around 257 horsepower, and features advanced engineering and aerodynamic design for its time. This particular Mercedes-Benz W196, with chassis number 0654, has a rich racing history. It was driven by the legendary Juan Manuel Fangio, who won the 1954 German Grand Prix in this car, as well as the Swiss Grand Prix and the Spanish Grand Prix. The car also competed in a number of other important races, including the 1955 Monaco Grand Prix, and was part of the dominant Mercedes-Benz team that won the 1954 and 1955 Formula One Constructors' Championships. After its racing career, the car was sold to a private collector and underwent a number of restorations and refurbishments over the years. In 2013, the car was sold by Bonhams at their Goodwood Festival of Speed auction for $29.6 million, making it one of the most expensive cars ever sold at auction at the time. The Ferrari 335 Sport Scaglietti is a rare and highly coveted race car that was built for endurance racing in the late 1950s. The car is powered by a 4.1-liter V12 engine, which produces around 400 horsepower, and features advanced engineering and aerodynamic design for its time. This particular Ferrari 335 Sport Scaglietti, with chassis number 0674, has a rich racing history. It was driven by a number of famous drivers, including Mike Hawthorne, Peter Collins, and Sterling Moss, and achieved a second-place finish at the 1957 Mill Miglia race. The car also competed in a number of other important races, including the 1957 24 Hours of Le Mans, where it finished fourth overall. It was one of only four 335 Sport Scaglietti models ever built, making it an exceptionally rare and valuable collector's item. In 2016, the car was sold by Art Curiel Motorcars at their Retromobile auction in Paris for $35.7 million. The Ferrari 250 GTO is widely considered one of the most beautiful and iconic sports cars ever built, and is a highly coveted collector's item. The car was built for racing in the early 1960s and is powered by a 3.0-liter V12 engine, which produces around 300 horsepower. This particular Ferrari 250 GTO, with chassis number 3413 GT, has a rich racing history. It was driven by famous drivers such as Phil Hill, Joe Bonnier, and Innes Ireland, 
and won a number of important races, including the 1962 Tour de France automobile. The car was also part of the legendary Ecurie Franker Champs racing team, which was based in Belgium and fielded a number of successful Ferrari race cars in the 1960s. In 2018, the car was sold by Erm Sotheby's at their Monterey auction for $48.4 million, making it the most expensive car ever sold at auction at the time. The car's stunning design, impressive racing history, and rarity, only 36 Ferrari 250 GTOs were ever built, have made it a highly coveted and valuable collector's item. The buyer's identity was not disclosed, but the car is believed to be in the hands of a well-known car collector. Thanks for watching our video on the most expensive cars ever sold. From classic Ferraris to vintage Mercedes-Benz models, these cars have captured the hearts and imaginations of car enthusiasts and collectors around the world. We hope you enjoyed learning more about these amazing vehicles and their fascinating histories. Which of these cars would you like to own, if money were no object? If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating content about cars, history, and culture. And if you have any suggestions for future videos, be sure to let us know in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.